one man was killed and a police officer shot at a busy casino. Now the FBI is asking for your help finding the second suspect involved in that shooting. Here's News 13's Gabrielle Burkhart. Dean Jessica, that Laguna Pueblo police officer was investigating a stolen car when he ran into these two men and things took a turn. While people inside were hitting up slot machines, placing bets, gambling into the night, a Laguna Pueblo police officer pulled into the Route 66 casino parking lot around 12.30 a.m. to investigate a reported stolen vehicle. We didn't know if maybe there was a fire or something or if there was just maybe somebody trying to rob the place or what was going on. There's probably let's say somewhere around eight cop cars. Hunter Smith was among the hotel guests who caught the aftermath. Thank God for the cops. Absolutely. Video released from the FBI shows the silver Lexus drive up to the casino. The officer, 37-year-old Peter Tanzilli, went to confront the two occupants of the Lexus. There's no sound in the police video, but investigators say Tanzilli was shot. You could just see the lights. There was a fire rescue vehicle that drove drove away too while we were pulling off the off ramp over there. One of the male suspects was then shot and killed, but the FBI is still looking for this man. He's seen on lapel video wearing black shorts with a white stripe, a black jacket with white trim and black shoes. He ran away from the scene. Tanzilli, a five-year veteran with Laguna Pueblo Police, is also a U.S. Air Force vet who moved here from Florida. He's recovering at UNMH. They're here to serve and protect us and thank God he was here. I hope he does a lot better and the guy that was shot, I hope that he's in a better place and he pays for his actions. Guests are thankful no one else was hurt. They just hope police catch up with the second suspect. The FBI Bureau of Indian Affairs, Bernalillo County deputies and APD all assisted Laguna Pueblo in this case. The identity of the man killed has not yet been released. Back to you. All right, Gabrielle, thank you. Police have not said who reported that vehicle stolen. Anyone with information is asked to call the FBI at the number 505-889-1300. And you can find that number and get a closer look at the suspect. Just go to our KRQE News app.